Hello, cats and dogs. They are now dragging here. Um, let me turn that down. There we go. Can I start a game with Mountain Blade Warband? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> to quickly buy and sell items. Yeah, no, duh. This is the Gecko Kujia mod, 1.16. And then other numbers after, but I'm just saying I'm running it off. I love the art in this mod, as you can see by if you can see my mouse. It's really good art. Sorry if you hear any background noise, it's stuff going on. I forget it always takes super long whenever you're first starting up a new game. There we go. Welcome adventure to Gakokuja. Before beginning this game, you must create your character. Remember that in the Sengoku era, war and p politics are usually dominated by male members of the no of the nobility. That does not, however, mean that you should not choose to play a female character or one who is not of noble birth. Male nobles have a somewhat easier start, but women and com commoners can attain all the same goals, and in fact, may have much more interesting of challenge early game. I'm gonna go male because that's what I am. You were born years ago in the land of, of the rising sun. Your father was a. a Shugaru? I'd say that goes. As a child, your family scra scra scrabbled out a meagerly living for your father's stampined as a retainer to the local board. It was not an easy existence, and you were too poor to get much of an education. You learned mainly how to defend yourself on the streets with or without a weapon in hand. You start to learn about the world almost as soon as you could walk and talk. You spend your early life as a... shop assistant. As a boy growing out of childhood, you apprenticed to a wealthy merchant picking up the tra trade of all years of working shops and driving ca caravans. You soon became adept to the art of buying low, low, selling high, and leaving the customer thinking they'd got a better deal. Then as a young adult life changed, as it always does, you became a traveling lack, I guess. Though the st distinction felt sudden to you, somewhere along the way you had become a man. And the whole world seemed to change around you. You set out on your own to, with nothing except the instrument strung over your back and your own voice. It was a poor existence, but mi with many a hungry nights and when people f failed to appreciate your play, but you managed to survive on your music alone. As the years went by, you became adept playing the drunken crowds in your inns and even better at talking anyone out of anything you wanted. But soon everything changed and you decided to strike out on your own as an adventurer. What made you take this decision was... I'd say considering uh, what we are is one of the last. Only you know exactly what caused you to give up your old life and become an adventurer. You are not even sure when your home became a prison, when your father became a mundane but, but your dreams of wandering have taken over your life. Whether well, you yearn... Oh, idiot. Sorry about that. Let me just say this. You 
côté. Place or merely of the open road and the freedom to travel. You can no longer bear to stay in the same place. You simply want to never look back. Uh, allow me to go this up too. Forging's pretty good. Uh, we're probably gonna most likely be only using a bow, because I love bows in this. Though we're probably not gonna start out with one, because sometimes you do and sometimes you don't. Uh, let me think. Dragon Souls the Hairs. Oh, whatever. I can't think of any good name for that. Let's see, what did I start with? Pole Arm, of course. Randomize till I get a good face. Yes, <laughs> that looks good. Good enough for me. You hear about Japan, a land torn between rival domios battling each other for supremacy, a haven for samurai and ronin, cutthroats and adventurers, and all willing to risk their lives in pursuit of fortune, power, and glory. In this land which holds great danger and even greater opportunities, you believe you may leave your past behind and start a new life. You feel that finally you held the key to your destiny in your hands, free to go to choose as you will, and that that whatever course you take, great adventures will await. Draw on the stories you hear about Japan and its providence. You join a cavern, tech cavern, caravan to Nagata in Icho, Ichoga province. Yeah, that's great naming. It looks like it's about the time you, f you find it in Nagata, an inn in Nagata, and fall asleep quickly. However, you wake before dawn and are eager to explore your surroundings. You venture out to get into the streets which are deserted. All of a sudden, you hear a sound that sends the hair in your neck to end. The rasp of a blade sliding out of its scabbard. I like going in between uh, this person. That's still too loud. There we go. Oh, sorry. Um, he just saying the merchant speaks to you and says that it's not good to talk out in the open and takes you into his home. And let me explain my proposition. I have tried all of my life while ignoring the samurai, even in these turbulent times. I figured that if I keep my head down, none of the plots of wars would affect me. I was wrong. They killed they killed my brother. Maramu, I don't know how to say that. Manmaru? He was a hot headed for sure. Maybe he showed disrespect to the hot hot lord. I don't know what exactly happened, but it does seem it doesn't matter to me whether he brought it open upon himself or not. Maybe he, nobody should be so exalted that they could kill a brother, son, or father just because they weren't groved to as they wished. This is no way for the rest of us to live. My other brother, Hariban Her Horamburu, tried to investigate the murder, but he disappeared since. I originally feared the worst, but I've just come across a rumor that says he's still alive as a captive, so here's what I'm asking of you. Gather a small party, track down who has taken him, teach them a lesson. They won't forget and get Horribun home safe. In return, you'll earn my eternal gratitude for a large sign on money. 
What do you say? I'm interested. Well, I'm sorry for my voices if you don't like them, but whatever. You won't be able to do it by yourself, this spice to yourself. Even if you try and take on a samurai and his retainers single handedly, you, you will slowly lose your head. You must round up a group of volunteers and form a band. There's always a few boys in the villages around here looking for work. That's more interesting than tilling the soil or hauling water. They'll follow you, if so take this purse of a hundred mon, consider it an offense on your reward. Go around the villages and get money and hire some help. I reckon that you'll need at least five men to take these scoundrels. Very good, sir. Very good, sir. I'll collect these some men from the villages around. Good. You can find me again in the ear in here in Nagata. Actually, after you get uh, your group together, then we'll speak about what we do next. Oh, yeah, not fun. Good. Okay, where am I? Oh, I'm here. We're going to lag. Oh, to sleep. <laughs> no, you can't touch me. <laughs> Spin. Yeah, I'm sorry for my pronunciations. Yeah, I'm instantly five. But I always know that's never gonna be enough. So we gotta go to here. Kill it with fire. Surrender or die. Judge the enemy. Yeah, 11 against 11. No need to be really tactical. Where are we in the map? Okay, we're there. Pretty far distance, but it'll do. We have no banner or anything. Yay! I guess after we get a couple of these guys leveled up from killing random looters and stuff, we shall uh, then take upon this quest. Thor seems to do more damage. Ooh. There we go. Gonna let them get the kills for now. Come on, throw a rock. Why don't you can hit him? Come on. Too bad we ain't got no actual archers. Come in. He's gonna go away. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, four looters. I can only take one. Okay. Oh, great. Wait, I only have two, so you'll actually do well. Yeah, money, free money. Just gonna let them kill them because they need the experience more than I do. Yeah. No, I don't want to do that. Oh well. Okay. Deserters patrolling. I don't. I don't know. If I'm... Yes, they're running. That instantly means attack. <laughs> Anytime anybody runs, that means yep, you can kill them. Doing. They're s like snipers. Hey, I got the same spirit as that guy. I'm pretty sure it's the Nakata. Oh, 
but I don't know. Come on, brothers. Ah! <laughs> My spine. If I can get a good bow from this. Oh, the villager killed, oh well. Don't go down. Only no, technically third bout, but. Let me get a kill, guys. <laughs> Oh. oh, hey. Who, who's left? Is there seriously just so, one other guy? If you can't, like, snipe that guy, you're instantly gonna get kicked out of my party. Like, seriously? Ugh, we need to get, like, an army of archers. <laughs> Yay, yay, that arrow must, must hit me. Yeah, I'm gonna lose you and then take you. There we go. Ooh, nice armor. I like this. Still no hat. I usually get a hat by now. Ooh, what is that? Looters! Easy prey. Yeah, instantly getting some trained people. Oh, dang. Oh, hey, got some hats. Do they even do anything? Nope, so I'm not gonna wear them. Oh, hey, I leveled up. Let's go. Wrong button. Uh, I'm gonna add this to intelligence. And get some iron flesh. Too bad they didn't drop any bows. Okay. Um, yes, I will help just because I can. Wait, I didn't want to be in this. Oh well. <laughs> I, I meant to do something else. Whatever. This will just be the ultimate get eaten charge. There's literally only four people, so. I meant to auto resolve this, but, um. Didn't work. Did, forgot, pressed the wrong button. <sighs> well, maybe I can get a kill. I just kinda wanna see one of these guys just get sniped from like a couple meters away. Hey, any XP right now or loot is really appreciated. Because we're not in the uh, greatness right now. Wow, you hit me. I must kill you now. any of that. Okay, I'm gonna go to the marketplace, horse, yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter who you sell it to. Yeah, so much money. I'm rich now. Can I get an actual sword? Nope. Nope. Where are you at? Who are you? Here's to the doom and the downfall of us. Okay, I want to hear this. Greetings there, brother. Here's to the doom and the downfall of all samurai. It's a long story, but if you uh, get yourself a drink, I'll be glad to tell. A townsman I was in here in at Nagata. Twenty years I worked as a common laborer, as I have before mentioned, taking heavy loads to other towns and taking the occasional hard knock. 
from bandits. It was all for the sake of my family. Then one day the province of priests, province's peace was broken by these wars between the daimyo. My particular district was brought under the domain of a snot-nosed, da downy-lipped samurai, barely out of his mother's cradle. He came upon me, my boss, and my co-workers walking down the road with loads of goods on our backs. We stepped off to let him pass, but we did not bow, for we wanted to be on our way, and we did not want to drop our loads. He thought it was a sign of disrespect and tried to cut us all down, invoking his right of Karakasu, yep, yeah, that's a word. Goman, luckily, I had a short sword hidden in my belt. I defended myself from highwaymen. My company, my companions were not as lucky. Now I'm getting, now I'm here getting drunk on, and on, and the only take tomorrow. If you're looking for work, I can use an experienced fighter. Oh, you know. Well, that's a sight better, sight better than having my head locked off in revenge. You won't regret taking me on, brother. I'm a dead eye with this sword sword, a beautiful weapon. It can ripe, it can ripe punch through a samurai's armor and spill his his blood upon the ground. Beg your, begging your pardon. Uh, I don't tattle, tattle uh, to a highborn. Good man. We'll treat you with the respect you do. Ah, dang it. My apologies, yeah. Do -do -do, sorry. Good man. We'll treat you with the respect you deserve. Of course, here's 200 mon. Yeah. Let's go. No, do the ant, not ant. Uh, market? A horse that just sold something really good. Oh, that's so cheap. I didn't think I was going to get a companion, so I didn't do it. Go oh, get ready to get eaten. I don't... What? Really? Y'all just get... Wow. I needed that. <laughs> A little better than mine. Not by a lot. Oh, well, I wonder why it's a little better. I'm gonna keep them on me because I'm only gonna get. So, where's my companion? Pachi. Oh, I didn't even move you up. Talk. Let me see your equipment. Yay. <laughs> Here's a hat for you. You don't need that. Once we beat these bad ones, go over here and get some more peeps. Still like looter heaven over here. Like, probably some treaty being made. Get him. Surrender or die. Yay. We better not lose as many as we just did, because that means it's just saying you all suck. <laughs>